Italy's antitrust authority said on Thursday it had launched a probe into tech giants Apple and Samsung for allegedly shortening the lives of their products so clients would buy newer models. But it's not just Cupertino that's being probed. The watchdog is also investigating Apple rival Samsung over the same claims. The group says both are suspected of orchestrating updates that induce consumers to buy new versions. If the investigation concludes that Samsung and Apple sent out updates that may have a negative impact on performance without warning customers, then both would be in violation of four separate articles of Italy's National Consumers Code. We're gonna give people the visibility of the health of their battery, so it's very, very transparent, this hasn't been done before," Cook said. That option, however, won't necessarily mitigate the claims of planned obsolescence against Apple as the throttling has been in place for almost a year. It's likely that the investigation is broader in scale, but prompted by the battery throttling case. When Apple first admitted that it had throttled the CPU on iPhone models beginning with the iPhone 6, many thought that Apple was taking a cue from the auto industry and was using planned obsolescence to force current iPhone users to update to the latest handsets. The watchdog says that users were not warned that software updates could cause their phones to slow down, and the two companies face fines in the millions if they are found guilty.